Hi everyone, it's GBGW time with Andrea, and today's video is going to be on um, how to get the most out of weekly events. And I was going to do it on attributes, but I decided because we have a new weekly event going on right now that I would do it on that instead. So, okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do when a new weekly event comes, and these happen every Tuesday evening at like 8 p.m. Pacific time, and ours at 7 p.m., I can't remember, 8 p.m. Pacific time. Um, you're going to want to sign in. There's going to be a download uh, that you'll need to do, and sometimes it'll be a big one. Sometimes it won't be. When you come, then you're going to come in, and this is what I do. The very first thing I do, I come in here, I go to my gunpla list, I pick my missions. That's the M should have died. M want to die. I'm going to die. M mission. You're going to hit event boost down here at the bottom, and it's going to pull up um, any parts that you have that offer a multiplier, a bonus, a bonus to your event, to your um, suit. So then you're going to go through and you're going to attach all of those, focus on higher parts with higher bonuses or whatever, you know, focus on the highest bonuses and give preference to the ones that are higher parts. Okay. Um, you're going to do that for three of your suits. You're going to give them all your bonuses. You're going to make sure you have a squad set up. That is just for these. So you're going to come in here and you're going to be like, I want this guy right here who has the bonus. And then I want this guy who has the bonus and, you know, this guy who has the bonus. And you click on event bonus and it'll show you your total bonus. Mine's 570% right now. I haven't drawn on any capsules. I might not this week. Okay, that's the first thing you're going to do. The second thing you're going to do is you're going to come over to missions and you're going to open up events and you're going to pick the very first mission that pops up under the weekly one. And they have a lot of mission events going on right now, but the one that is the weekly one, this one is the extreme radiance. It's usually going to be the one that has the bonus, the percentage right here. So go through all of the the um, current events that are up and pick the one that has the bonus on it. Okay. Then you're going to play the very first one, um, five times. Now, the reason you want to play the first one five times is because every time you play it and pass it, um, and clear it doesn't need, you don't need to have all the check marks. You just need to clear it. It's going to give you a part for the weekly welfare suit. The weekly welfare suit is the suit that they're focusing on for that week the current week, and it's going to be one that you're going to want to equip right away. So I just, I did all that part last night and then realized I'm, like, I'm going to want to do a video on this dirt. So then you're going to come in here, click on event and extreme, extreme Gundam is the weekly one. So you're going to equip that. And the reason you want to have these going equipped instead of a different suit is because um, you want to have them upgrading while you're using them so that when you face the situation, you're not going with a completely empty, um, complete level one suit. So you come in here, you tag all of these and you equip all of these and make sure you've got it set up the way you want it. And, um, yeah, there now this is going to be in here under your squad for your missions under your suit for your missions it's going to be leveling up as you use that suit um, so that when you face the situation it'll be ready now one thing to note not every one of these parts is going to be filled with not all of these is going to be filled with a part that has a bonus so when this week is over don't spend all of your coins and i'll show you why so the extreme shield, you saw that I had that on all three of my suits because I ran out of bonus. I didn't have any, um, any shields that had a bonus. So going to come in here, you're going to find the extreme, um, coin exchange and you're going to fill in, you're going to take the coins. They'll give you 30 coins about is what they gave this time for finishing those first few missions. And you're going to buy suits or buy the parts and fill in the blanks. Now, sometimes the weekly suit will only offer these five right here. And when that happens, you're going to want to save and you'll want to do this before the weekly, the before Tuesday night, don't spend all of your coins from the previous week's suit because you're going to want to come in here and say, 
dang it, I need a weapon with a bonus or, you know, I need a melee or a ranged weapon or a pilot or whatever. This is what happened. I needed a pilot. So I came in here and I bought three pilots, three extra pilots so that I could have a bonus for all my pilots. Um, not every, every suit is going to have everything. And so just keep that in mind, save some of your cash from the previous event so that when the new event comes, you know, if you're going to need bonuses or not. Okay. Then, um, so yeah, so save and you'll end up using the previous week's suit quite a bit. Um, and then after that, after you get your whale fare suit, you're going to focus all your time on event missions as possible. You have one week to take advantage of the event missions. So you're going to come in here and you're going to do the weekly event as much of, as much of this as you can. So I've already done this one right here and just for purposes of this video, but you're not going to want to do any of the daily missions or any of the free missions. You're going to focus all of your EN on these missions right here for the weekly event. The reason for that is it gives you coins based on your bonus that you're, that you set up on your suit that you spend in the shop that I was just in. Plus it gives you weekly event achievements. And I'm going to show you that in a minute, but first you're going to want to set up as, um, you're going to have two suits probably or two squads that your powerful squad, the one that can beat whatever you can, your toughest things. And then you're going to have one that has the bonus multipliers. Um, you'll use your bonus multiplier suit on as many of these as you can. Um, and pass as high up as you can, getting as many of those check marks as you can. And then perhaps use your um, beefy one. See, this is my beefy suit um, um, squad. It's got the highest CPWR. Um, then once you've got them beat, once you get all these three check marks beat, then you can use a skip ticket. Um, a skip ticket allows you to get the benefits from the mission without having to physically fight it. So it gives you... And you don't, you can use a weaker suit on it. So you can use your bonus suit, that 570, and it gives you the bonus um, as if you had just played that. But because it uses a skip ticket, you don't have to use one of your tougher suits. So it gives you these bonuses right here. So did you see that one? Um, my, okay, so 12 plus 69. So I did it on the highest um, difficulty. Now let me go show you what it looks like on the lower one. So it's 12 plus 69. That was the 69 was the bonus I got and 12 was the base I got. Now we're going to see right here, the base is one and the bonus is six. So, um, you're not going to want to spend your EN on those lower levels. You can do them if you want to get the, the prizes from them, but I'm going to encourage you to spend your EN on the higher ones. So on this one right here, so spend all of your EN on this sorty, 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 sorty with skip tickets and you can do with ticket rematch right here and just keep going until you run out of EN. And then I will show you where those bonuses are going to end up, where the event mission, or sorry, the, the mission achievements end up. Um, and you might have noticed the exclamation point down in the corner there. That exclamation point will tell you how far you've gone in the achievements so that you don't have to exit out of the mission. And if I remember, I'll show you that again in just a bit here. But then you'll come over to achievements and events events and this is where you're going to get all of your clear any mission 10 times clear events super hard super hard and as you'll notice um let me go up to the harder levels hard very 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 super hard super hard you get the better stuff with the harder missions see look at this and this is also good um, so the harder you do, the more, the better the bonuses are. So you're going to want to focus, focus as much as your attention on the higher events because they give you, um, better coins, but they also give you better, uh, bonuses in here. Um, do the other ones as well, just so you can get the haro from them. Uh, let's see what else was I going to say. Um, okay. So let me show you really fast that little check mark that I was just talking about when you're in the event things. Um, now when it comes to spending your money, so it's going to be giving you money and I will show you sorty with ticket. It gives you a, um, again, like I said, it gives you a base percent, a base thing, and then it gives you a percentage. So this is my base and this is my bonus. This is the percentage that's based on the bonus that I have, but you saw that I just clicked on the exclamation point and it shows you, look, this is what I've completed, right? Um, Okay, so then when you have your coins and, you sp and you've worked really, really hard, don't spend your money until you get a feel for how much you're going to be earning. 
and I'll show you why. So you come over to the shop, exchange, go to the extreme coin exchange. You've got all these awesome parts in here. Um, it might be tempting to buy all the gold parts. Don't do that. Okay. It might be tempting to buy all of these things. Don't do that. It might, again, you know, it's, it's tempting to spend coins on things in here, but until you get an idea for how hard um, it is to get coins, just save your money up. Um, oh, interesting. They're giving us a color this time. Sometimes they do. Sometimes they don't. Um, then I'm going to encourage you to focus on what I usually focus on are these things right here. Um, the harder ones to get, these are really hard to get. They're really rare. They cost a lot of money, but I focus all of my energy on getting as many of those as possible. Um, and then after that, sometimes I'll buy these things. I try to buy all of these things. Um, try to buy these ones right here. See, it's zero out of five, and they only cost 10 coins compared to this, which is 500. So buy these ones here. I buy these. And then after I've got the important things out of this, I will go over to the parts and I'll say, okay, how much do I need and what do I want? So let's look at these right here. I have not checked these out yet. This is what we are, we've been given this time. So... Um, and not a super fantastic shot attack with saber category equipped shooting power boosted 8%. That's not too bad, actually boosted 25%. So that's, that's really good if you're using a saber and I'm assuming they're giving us a saber. Yes, they're giving us a saber. So the reason I say this is not very good is because this max right here will be between three and 4,000 instead of 2000. So just, you know, that's something to re remember. Now, this is a standard. This is pretty standard for a weekly chest. It's not fantastic, not horrible. I've seen worse. Buff EX skill effect up for 15%. Um, hands, let's see. Again, these are these are pretty standard. Um, that's really good. Melee defense and shot defense. With speed attribute, melee power boost at 25%. This is a really good one. That's, that's really good. You're going to want to buy that and max that out. Uh, max out the... This, the um, um, which we call it. So what you'll do is you'll buy it here and then you'll come up and you'll buy 12 hands and then you'll merge them and that'll max out your part trait. It'll max this out. Okay. Let's see the legs. Um, standard before six seconds pass enemy, enemy melee power reduced 25%. That's actually pretty good. So that means that you can within, if you can beat it within a, the first minute, then their powers reduce quite a bit. Um, B minus, not as fantastic. You want to aim for, when it comes to the EX skills, you're going to want to aim for ones that are like B and higher. That means they're most, they're most powerful. Um, so that's not too bad. I mean, it's, you know, it's not the best 21% of checks. That's not super, you know, that's not super great. Um, and I'm not going to go into the whys right now about that, but so you're going to come through. Oh, that's cool. Ace exclusive. I didn't notice any of the tags on these. Ace exclusive. Really nice. The shield. Not terribly great. That's not good. Not terrible. Look at that. Recover 48% of your maximum armor. Raise your melee shot attack by 19%. That's pretty good. Okay. So the one that I would recommend you buy is going to be this one right here. And I recommend you're going to max that out. Um, was it this one that I also recommended? Or was it the head? I can't remember. Yes, the head. So then you're going to go through these after you just, after you buy all the other things under items. You're going to go under the parts and you're going to pick out the ones that are best and you're going to gold those. Okay, you're going to buy them in gold and then you're going to buy, do them one at a time, pick you the most important one, do it one at a time, buy it, then come up and buy 12 of the equivalent up here, then go merge them um, or buy another one and then buy the next one and then get as many and get 12 of these or as many of them as you can get. Um, and the reason you want to go one at a time is because these coins run out, obviously, and you want to buy the most important things first. Um, don't spend money on the lesser items. Don't come in here and buy, you know, all of these max. Um, don't buy all of these until you have purchased better things. Okay. Don't just don't spend any money until you have an idea for how much you're going to get. I usually will actually wait until like Sunday and then I'll come in and buy and see how I'm doing. And then I know whether I need to focus harder on the event missions, like spending, um, Ian fill, you know, Ian recovery things or not, um, to get what I need. And I forgot they're giving us, ex um, expiring Ian things this time. That's pretty awesome. Okay. 
Um, as I said, use your toughest suit to beat the, the missions initially, then skip ticket with the bonus suit because you'll want that bonus. Um, don't spend money until you get a feel for how much you're earning. Beat as high as you can, then focus your EN on higher levels. Um, don't, don't spend your time on the daily or the free missions until you get, until you get, um, as much out of the event as you possibly can. So these ones right here, just ignore these right here until you've beat as much in there as you can on the weekly event. Um, and then capsules is another thing to recognize with every event. They give us capsules. They give us awesome bonus, bonus things. So, um, they'll, you'll see they have like these things right here. These are limited events, special things that they're doing right now. These, and then down here, yep. You can tell I bought, I bought one of these, uh, two of those. Um, then let's see, which one is it? I can't remember where it is. Um, those of you who've been playing GBGW for a very long time, you're going to be like, what the heck? She's, she's, um, at the wrong thing. Um, then they end up, they come in here and they will give us every week, they give us a new pilot, um, to add to the regulars. Um, so you'll come in here and there's going to be new pilots that they're adding. There's going to be new parts that they're going to add. And, but the thing with these is you don't want to spend your Haro on those because they're going to end up coming over and joining right here. Okay. So, oops, that's not what I wanted. So. Yeah, see, some of these are over. Let me show you, okay? So come over here, um, AI pilot capsules, drop rate. So the new ones, we've got Rain, um, Orga. Looks like Orga's the new one. Trawa, Barton, that's family name, by the way, for me. Navalgato, Shigaya, she, she, I don't know. You guys can tell me how to say these. Orga, it looks like Orga's the new one for this week. So, and Orga isn't terrible. Um, pretty standard for a defender, um, okay. So they drop, just dropped Orga in there. You come over here, standard drop rate. Rain was the new pilot from last week. And next week, Orga is going to be added in here. You have every day, a free chance, um, to get, it'll be, you know, this right here will be one free thing. You have a chance to get those pilots every single day. And same with those suits. Um, I can't remember which one it is. Standard pack up, standard pickup. Anyway, the, it, the ones that you're going to be want to spend, wanting to spend your Haro on will be the limited things like, like Freedom Gundam, if you want the Freedom Gundam and Justice Gundam. Um, some of these will be good. Uh, this one's pretty good. I've seen some of the people in my Discord server have pretty good success with those. What time is it? I have to leave for my MRIs here in a couple minutes. Anyway, so those always end up over here. So don't spend money on the standard things because they're going to end up over here. So AI, AI pilots, the standard things, don't spend Haro on those. Spend them on the more important ones, like the Sokai. These ones are generally going to be worth it, okay? Not worth it as in you're going to get something good every time, but they're worth spending Haro on because the chance of getting something good is better. Okay, so that's pretty much it for this video. Um, um, yeah, I, I think that's everything. So focus on your bonus. This is another reason. This right here, by the way, you come in here. Um, hit the bonus. This is a reason why I save one of everything. Look, Gundam Arius, for example, is not one that somebody wouldn't likely sell, but people do sell, like say the ACK guy right here. Um, he might have a bonus on him sometimes and end up being something that you would want to use. And so I save one of pretty much everything because you never know when you're going to need a future bonus. And that's huge. It saves money in the future because then you don't have to spend hard to see if you can get one of the random drops from the capsules. Um, that's pretty much it. Uh, wish me luck with my MRIs today. I'm getting, um, two, no one head MRI with and without contrast, and then two spinal MRIs, both with and without contrast. Um, so that's technically three MRIs, but you now wish me luck with that. Got to figure out what's going on with me. I've been dealing with some health problems lately. Um, um, hit the like and the subscribe button comment below. If you have anything you want to add to the, to the discussion, hit the bell icon to be alerted to future videos. Come join my discord server. The link is in the description and I will talk to you all later. Bye.